I think some philosophy of law has been one of my favourite subjects at school. Um, and I think a lot of the theories that we do learn, they do relate to your life. And I think when I first started, I had my kind of like set opinions on things. And now it's changed a lot. Very, very interesting overall. There's never been a lesson that's boring. I like to think deeply, I like to debate topics and I like to, and I liked a lot of the content. It was nothing like what I expected, it was much better. Um, we learn new things and it's not all about religion, it's about philosophy as well. It was interesting to know what kind of you know, views people have on those subjects because you might only have had your own perspective or your parents' perspectives than you had before that. So then also like perspectives that were originally from a, a lot earlier on. It's interesting to look at. I did it at GCSE. I really enjoyed it. It was one of my two favourite subjects alongside English and I wanted to go into a lot more depth with it. It's like uh, one of my favourite A-levels uh, because you, know, you go in depth about a lot of things. It sort of opens your mind. Um, I like the group discussion because you get to understand other people's views because um, like my opinion would be very different to others so you get to learn from other people and get to change your kind of thinking and understanding and like appreciating that other people's got different opinions to you. Well the lessons have been really good, we've done a lot of debates, met a lot of people, it's actually the, the topic itself and the stuff we look at that's really really interesting. In the ethics part of the course I learnt about different ethical dilemmas such as abortion and euthanasia and how they can be applied to your lives in different situations and also we learnt about different ethical theories and like how you can apply those to all the different ethical dilemmas and try and make a decision that you think would be morally right. With Kant it's all about duty and um, every human has an obligation to do certain things, for example don't treat someone as a means to an end. Um, and then there's utilitarianism which is the greatest happiness for the greatest number. So every time you come across a decision you have to ask yourself who is it affecting and the happiness level involved. We looked at the existence of God and we also, that's the philosophy side, but the ethics side we looked at, um, you know, euthanasia, abortion. Well we had like the different topics and some of them were to do with like arguments for and against God and all the philosophers and things like that. And then we looked at evil and suffering, which was why, why is it a problem when it comes to God? How can we argue against God with evil and suffering? And then there was religion and science, which is quite interesting, and how they kind of, they can go together, but they can clash as well. When I looked at the course online, it was like, what is knowledge? And you're like, well, what is knowledge? <laughs> it's kind of, um, it's weird. You, you think to yourself about it before you even start going into it. And you just, it, it's something that you really roll over in your head even after you've stopped talking about it. It's enjoyable because, you know, you open your mind to so many different topics. And, you know, you sort of uh, learn things about yourself as well, about, you know, what kind of person you are morally and ethically. I, I felt very well prepared for the exam, actually. Um, I did lots of past papers and uh, I, I knew almost everything from the, from from the teaching. You can make some posters, uh, presentations even, sometimes even role play. Well, we, we've made lots of posters, we've um, done presentations, we've practiced writing essays, which is very important. I got lots of support from my teachers because if I did need support, I could go to like um, additional support, which was like on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and the teachers were willing to help me. I think both teachers are down to earth. Um, they, they talk with you on an individual level yet we often have class discussions and hear the views of other people. The teachers are really good. Um, I think they're both really passionate about it. I feel that the course isn't, it's not, we're not just working towards an exam, it's kind of, we're talking about our lives, we're talking about our beliefs. And actually, I, I believe that philosophy and ethics really does kind of shape the way that we live. I would say definitely consider it because it is really, really interesting. It does give you a new way that you look at different ethical decisions and how you look at the world and how you feel in yourself as a person. Do it, it's great. Um, you learn a lot of things and you, you come out with an open mind about. So when you look at different situations in the world, you look at it from an ethical and a philosophy point of view. It really gives you knowledge. Yeah, definitely 100% take it because it's one of my favourite A-levels and um, it's really enjoyable to do and um, it does extend a lot of your skills such as essay writing and thinking more openly about things and yeah makes some good conversations as well outside of class.